we are based in Arusha here at the uh, Nelson Mandela African Institution of Science and Technology. This is a public university which is um, it's a research intensive university. That means that we, we are only enrolling masters and PhD students and also postdocs. The landscape of our students here at Nelson Mandela is um, the Eastern Africa. So we have all students from all the EAC uh, member, member states, but we also from Malawi, Zambia, Comoro. Here at the university we have uh, four schools. There's one school which deals with the ICT. We have another school which deals with life sciences. We have another which deals with material science, energy and environmental science. And we have another school which deals with business studies and the humanities. Welcome. the incubation office we have 58 innovations which are different process or levels including prototype, idea, patent, copyright etc. But in the 58 innovations the IPC Intellectual Property Committee selected seven most potential innovations to enter within incubations for the process of development and the commercializations. For Tanzanians, it's the big step to, to have these incubations because it's new for the countries in the Africa's continent at all. Some of the innovations are the early stages, including electricity consumption and the forecasting system as explained by the student. We are working on a laboratory management system prototype. Currently in the laboratories, there is a problem that all the processes are done manually. So there is no proper way of identifying samples, there is no proper way of recording sample storage conditions. So that's why we came up with this prototype to be able to digitize and automate all the processes in the laboratory. So we are able to monitor the temperature conditions and also for the humidity. So these two sensor nodes, they send the temperature and humidity data using Zigbee. They send to a coordinator. Then from the coordinator, all this data is processed and pushed to the cloud. From the cloud, the users can be able to access all this data from a web application. This is how you monitor it, and this one is online. You can access this one as well. So if I take this one, this is the, the light intensity measured in candela. So what this one does, it will collect now this energy that has been consumed here, and the energy that has been consumed there, they are transmitted wirelessly using that ZB model. And, and it, from there now you would know this side is consuming this amount of energy, that side is consuming that amount of energy. Here at the university we are now um, doing a big transformation. We want to be in best of the future. We are going for the 5D uh, business and motion mode for the university. So it means for us we shall have research and innovation postgraduate training, incubation management, and we shall have the industrialization and technology transfer. We need to feed it to our model, which is the academia for society and industry.